before you get into an argument with somebody, make sure that you can articulate the good that they that they see out of their approach. Now, you don't have to agree with their conclusion, but to really be addressing them, you should be able to articulate what they're trying to get at. Because most people aren't operating just on pure malice, right? Their approach, they see something good in their approach. And before you can really have a constructive conversation with them, you should be able to articulate that. We all go into these conversations with these ironclad narratives, right? And the problem with these ironclad narratives is that they're usually partially fictional, but we don't admit, and this is the credibility again, we don't admit that they're somewhat fictional. But for Christians, we should always be able to admit that our narratives aren't necessarily perfect. I mean, if you think about it, how many people went up to Jesus and walked away with their narrative intact? <laughs> and part of having intellectual humility is to be able to say, no, there are some things that my side gets wrong. And not only say that to yourself, actually turn around and tell your side, no, that's not true. Yeah, that's not real. We have to admit that that's, we're really not that perfect. And they can, the other side can see we're really not that perfect. And all we're doing is losing credibility by holding on to those ironclad narratives.